Hey everyone, this is an archive of the One in the Drop Pod event, a head-to-head -head DRG tournament. The original tournament stream and commentary was lost, and this is the only remaining footage. I have trimmed this down to just the games and asked Scaps and Harlem to redo the commentary with me. For more information about the rules in the bracket, that can be found in the description, along with the timestamps for specific matches. I hope you enjoy. Thanks. Well, okay, game one, we have Harlem and Johnny. This is the first game of the tournament. Round well, luckily, one, now we have one. Millie, Harlem, and myself, Mr. Scaps. Yeah, brought back Harlem luckily. for the commentary, and Scaps, who wasn't there for that. My first look. Once again, this is Harlem and Johnny, I gotcha. Only quality gameplay from Mr. Harlem here. Oh, of course. Sure, I mean, Harlem Sweep, right? Definitely 3 0. Yup. It's gotta be weird to post commentate. <laughs> Is it? <laughs> Your own game. I yeah. thought. I don't see. Why have I thought me? I saw the, uh, the Kronos <laughs> in, and <laughs> I, I was like, nah, surely not. I forgot it's Harlem. That's the yeah, best part is that somebody else did recognize this when Harlem had the, the outfit on. Look, I'm kind of... What is with that? Uh, the camera is a there. little rough. Doing? I'm sorry, in the beginning it takes me a while to get used to it. Yeah, I think we're all getting used to the, the first time. I think um, there should be... You know how Minecraft has that cinematic cam? Yeah. You should have the same thing for Deep Rock. We only got the camera working about... 35 minutes before we had to start oh. so, um, but it it's it's a pretty nice resource to have there was a follow function that works for it but there was a issue with um, like latency or something along those lines oh we have yeah. the first death oh Johnny off cam so this is gonna be a trend that happens since I only have my point of view um, people will die off cam and that'll just have to happen that way that's tough it is a little tough, but this is, you know, lemonade. What class is lemons. Johnny playing? I missed that. I'm pretty sure. Scout. I right? believe Johnny was also on the scout, yeah. Yeah. I think it was two special oh. pattern scouts. Okay. We both had different both, or both Drax, but different number clocks. Oh, I gotcha. So we got game two here. But yeah, we had a, a follow cam set up for it, but the latency made it jitter a bunch, so we went with manually following players. Harlem took like a million damage right off the gate from... Yeah, I was not expecting this by Fallen, and then I got caught. And then I also got caught by this guy too. And then yeah. Okay. Yeah, not the best oh, thing. Then. Healing? Ooh. Oh, healing. Yeah, I did find all the red sugar, but yeah, that guy... It's probably the first time Harlem has even seen that enemy. Yeah, I, yeah I've seen it <laughs> three times, I think, total. Yeah, I got caught trying to get out of there. Oh my god. Her ass. He's too smooth with it, I don't know. Oh. Yeah. Why did I say that? <laughs> <laughs> Good time, <yeah. laughs> You must have had zero HP to die from that. All day. Yeah, I had, um... I got hit again. Like, no health from the Mactera. And then just fell and died to the fall damage. I'm like... Man, these are quick. Oh, I forgot. You, you did say that you cut them up. I did cut out the the in-between stuff, and unfortunately, I was not the camera doing the builds before the matches, so that information is kind of up in the air a little bit, like what people specifically had. It doesn't super matter, because you can see like a lot of things people had, like Special Powder or RJ or whatever, you know? But yeah, unfortunately, you won't see any build information for the players. Now, are these seated? Yeah, these were seated. They were actually all hand picked out by H2, Mira, and Cube. They did it together, I think. I I'm not oh, sure. Oh, I do remember reading that. I do remember yeah. reading that. They went and got all the seeds individually and looked and checked them all first. Um, but it could have been weird because they were checked like on vanilla. And we are playing, uh, like, a modded difficulty, and so, I don't know. It could change some of the stuff you see in the caves, like the enemies or whatever, but... Mm -hmm. There's one Classic. match later where 
uh, one of the cave's layouts is very hard for one of the classes that goes to it. I'll point Ooh. it out when we get there. I gotcha. The classic BRG oh. jump and, and jump and scoot. <laughs> Third no! attempt here, go for it, and no! he does it. Oh, he got it out. I got it out, but... The Stalker did so much okay. damage. The Stalker all throughout the tournament is... just so lethal. I don't remember it doing that much damage. It was mostly the, like, the... Oh, it's so like, fast. The freaking Scorpion guys with the red... Bat. Oh, the... And, and then whatever, whatever damage I took there was really bad, too. I think oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I agreed way too hard for the arc should not have done that. No! Oh, man, there we go. That's tough. That Dead didn't even look like it hit you. Harlem sweep. No, it did not hit me, but... I'm lucky. <laughs> Hashtag scammed. I get <laughs> scammed? What do you mean scammed? <laughs> I think the first... I was told uh, it was best of one, and if it was best of one, I would have won. <laughs> That's true, we did pad out <laughs> out to have more games. So Harlem did get scammed, yeah. <laughs> Hearing is easy, down. and the SC Peach. Yeah, two scout. Hopefully, down. I'm saying that mm -hmm. correctly. Is it double scout? Yeah, double yeah. scout. Classic. I mean, in in oh, the point extraction missions, I I really expected nothing less. Now I am looking forward to see if any non-scout classes are going to be picked. But. I know, I, I was kind of worried at this point too, where we had two different sets of people both play scout, and I was like, oh man, it's definitely going to be the most played for this. I hope other classes get played. I mean, double scout's probably better than double gunner and, you know, stalling, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> There's a lot of advantage scout has for sure in this. Uh, yeah, grapple's a huge boon, and there's a whole lot of other fights we have for me, man, so... It's no, you like, could... Go ahead. It. <laughs> yeah, it's like, it's either scout, or you just like, I don't know, drill around the map, or just control with gunner, so... Like, NG has a uh, RJ, but it's not nearly as effective as grapple. Yeah. I was thinking maybe, like... If you really wanted to, in the future, you could always modify... Or, or artificially add, after a certain amount of time... A certain enemy that counters a specific class, you know? Yeah. That, that would maybe could be a way scare to people do it. Yeah, into that's, playing. That's a good point. There could be, like, potentially some sort of redeems that could be done by uh -huh. an admin or something, you know? Yeah. To add those things into the match. That's a good idea. Ooh. Tough spot? No, he's alright. I like that idea because I was. There are a few things that I'm definitely thinking might have to change for future rounds. And that's kind of a fun way to deal with, with problems I see happening. Ooh. Even yeah. something like randomly oh, just and grapple with you. Really good as well. Yeah. Oh, yeah. We're just getting a longer period on each other. Small tweaks. Small tweaks. Small tweaks. Would, if, if... Oh, okay, stolen? Stolen? <laughs> You oh like? my goodness! So I guess now is a good time to talk about the rules because we've been kind of just coasting. But the friendly fire is turned off, but things you do can still interact with other players. So the objective then is just to just to survive and you know. Oh, okay. Oh, Peach died here, but it, off screen. That's okay. I think I'm not sure who had the quirk lead here, but we did have I think the first steal. But the idea is to survive first, and then beyond that, the stones, the aquark says, the secondary condition, if both players live or finish the mission, the person who's turned in more wins. I gotcha. So that's why people are even messing with that element. That's probably what baited Harlem into losing the stones. Next time for sure. Yeah. I wasn't expecting how lethal the map was going to be, so I was definitely greeting way too heavy on this game. Yeah. I'm thinking, um, oh, oh, I don't know, I feel like I more. wanted to, I would have wanted to just camp the spawn and try to yoink a quarks rather than do yeah. it myself, but then you're, but then you're staying around in the same spot for a long period of time, so. Yeah. Which if you're doing good. that, you're pulling aggro on the other part. Yeah, exactly. 
go into a hole and stay there. So yeah, yeah we everything. we will definitely see some variation on that same idea as well, which is good. It luckily is... isn't going to be all scout the whole way. Minor. I was going to say this is so. round two oh, yeah. of the second match. Um, yeah, round. Two. Yeah, that's right. Double scout again, right? Right, yep. and Peach lost the previous round, so gearing is one ahead here. Yeah, I don't think there were rules about swapping wood out. Oh, and wow, quick. Yeah, That's, I mean, enough. it just didn't take enough aggro off there, but it was carrying in the first round. Pharaoh definitely yeah. seems really good in that way. Maybe Pharaoh band? <laughs> yeah, so I guess a good thing to talk about here now, too, is that. Um, uh, the only things that were banned were cryo grenades and the cryo cannon itself. Yeah, after this event, uh, we talked about it a little bit. The cryo grenades may be unbanned because of it taking three cryo grenades to freeze um, outside of glacial. The problem was glacial strata, really. But because it takes so many grenades to freeze, maybe it'd be okay to have one or two freezes come from the player, you know, and not be a big deal. No, but the cryo cannon is very oppressive in this format. Is switching of builds and classes allowed between rounds? Yeah, yeah, it's definitely free to try whatever you want. That was the only restriction, the only ban was that. I, I might be blanking on something else, but... Uh, I think it's just those two. Yeah. Oh, no, there were perk bans, so no iron will. Um... Oh yeah, that's right. No field medic, which was a little odd. Uh, no shield link either, so you can't get the regen next to that teammates. Yeah, so the field medic one, that, that obviously doesn't matter. We just didn't want to have um, something happen where we, as moderators, just didn't see what happened and it instantly get, like fly under the radar. Like Iron Will instant res or, I don't know, somehow field medic somebody reses somebody else really fast. Yeah. So... Yeah. Um, the shield link one, I'm not sure exactly. Uh, I don't know how much it really impacts it, but there is a bug currently with shield link and one mod with the HUD and stuff like that. So possibly it was to prevent people from blinding other players because of this interaction that exists. But um, yeah, I'm not not exactly sure. But Harlem's right. That looks that like a looking. second steal. Yeah, this is a... Here. Yeah, well, successful steal, looks like. No, it hasn't been turned in yet. This is the best part about the steal, because letting go means the other person has a chance to grab it, oh. but holding it means you're slow enough to get. Ah. Uh, so it was stolen back, which was sick. That was back. good, stolen back. But if, if you have to hold it, Crisis the averted. enemies will catch up to you, you know? Yeah, which is nice. Sure. Yeah, Cape, uh, Cape Scout had to drop it because they were getting swarmed, and then perfect time to swoop in and grab it back. Yeah. This is this is unfortunate. The the thing missing from the other view um, <clears throat> is just the running tally of the stones. Oh. Is oh, that a very steal? nice. Yeah, that it was, was a steal. Right? Yeah. Was it? It was. Yeah. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, because Millie's. Yeah, Gearing brought that down and. Gearing. Then Peach stole it. Very nice right now. I apologize for not getting the names. The, the first yeah, round it's... went so quick, I barely even remember that it was Harlem and Joe. It is a little hard to keep up with this edited and, down. And those guys I already know. So. <laughs> yeah, I know you had the, the mod of the there. names, but I don't know why they're not a good system phase now. Yeah, it's, it's something uh... to do with the orientation of the camera. That's right, versus yeah. Versus where they're at. So like when I'm behind the player, it doesn't seem like it's it's showing up. This is interesting. No, I wonder if that's <clears> a <throat> your orientation to the player, or your, if it's like a north south thing. I'm not sure. Are we getting some troll in here? <laughs> I like the goo it, attempt. I think I missed that before, but the little like goo attempt. Oh, I is... saw yeah. And then gearing Ooh. died. To all oh, these bugs. gearing died. That's tough. Our <clears throat> winner. So it's uh, tied up 1-1 one, one now, so we go into a game 3 here. Is that only game 2? Yeah, those 2 out of 3 for them. Oh, oh, wait. Uh, oops. No, on the left. <laughs> that was the last game, sorry oh, about that. Oh, that was 2. So Peach won that 2-1. Or... 
Peach won that two, two one. one. So, two. I'm sorry, I forgot that one where Garen Donald. died in the in the glacial map really fast. Sorry. About I that. haven't I haven't seen the uh. Did, is Dora's not in this right? No, but Dora did. Dora and Shino contributed to the prize pool. Oh, I gotcha. Which was for the viewers at home. Um, a bunch of games on Steam. Uh, Morrowind was one of them, and a few other oh, classic. classic titles, as well as uh, DLC for the game was donated, and even uh, cores through a mod if if people wanted to get. Oh, that's Forge, cool. Forge, which was, I thought, a pretty cool thing. In I game, think that's reasonable, yeah. In-game thing. I wouldn't be. Okay. Sorry about the camera oh. there. No worries. We saw it stuck it right in underneath the gunner nose. <laughs> We're following uh, Donald here, I believe. I was going to say, um, I think looking at this bracket, I don't know. I, I haven't, I, I didn't get a chance to watch it because I was working, so I wanted to pick a favorite before everything started. Mm-hmm. <laughs> And uh, yeah, it's cheaty because you know this is already round three. But I was gonna say Harlem for the for the lols, but Harlem's already lost, so my money's on Donald. I think. Yeah, Maybe I going into it, I had, I really wanted Harlem to win. <laughs> it would have been crazy. It would have been sick. For no, sure. There's no shot. There's just Harlem's so rusty, you know. But I I don't know. I don't yeah. want to focus on that. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> no, Too much pressure on the boy. <laughs> Yeah, but you drag me back in. <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah, I have a. Uh, I think the most I played is was uh, doing speed running, and that was like two hours. <laughs> yeah. So. Yeah. For a long time. I mean, even Very still, this back. is modded difficulty, right? So it's abnormally. This is modded. Yeah. If, this even is even if a, you were used to playing, you know. This is a. Yeah, I got oh, thanks for the gunners upline. That looked like. Yeah. This yeah, is. I, uh, that's tough. This yeah, was one of the maps that's very hard. I think Gunner has a huge disadvantage, just happens to be on this map. Like, it's very vertical, and it's a mismatched mobility matchup, for sure. And, uh, yeah, I think Dottle has just a lot of freedom to take time with turn-ins and stuff like that. But I don't know. Did you guys yeah. on stream talk about the uh, like map layouts and stuff beforehand, or, or like as they were happening? Did you talk about the maps at all? Um, a little bit. Where there there are some interesting things that happen with some of the maps, but like as you've seen, some of these matches just go so fast. Yeah, so there's, there's a lot like of not a lot to analyze with some of the maps. Okay, we oh, have this. Resupply. We have this now place. The resupply is a big part of this. So in the format, I was going to talk about the, the modded aspect of it too. So in the game mode that we have, there are some slight changes, like there's no player damage between players. There's also one resupply at the beginning given, and so whoever wants to call it first can. And um, this adds a little bit more drama to the map as well, because of where it's going to be, how it's going to be interacted with and stuff. And so that's a that's that will become a pretty central theme in some of these um, games coming up. I think even in this game, unfortunately, we can't see it. But right now, I can tell you from memory, um, the gunner is going to go eat a lot of those resupplies. <laughs> <laughs> Just goes over and steals them. I think here in this. Yeah, first well, you can match. see it on the highlight over there. Yeah. Probably grab the weapon and then start eating them. Yeah, I don't, know, I don't think we talked about the matchup yet. Gunner versus Scout. Um, I think Gunner's been on the point the whole time. So yeah. I mean, resupply, but you're okay. Just hoping... I, I mean, you gotta be hoping that Scout just messes up, right? Yeah, and I think there is some... That's what you're on. There is some small hope that's fair there, which is, like, if Scout plays into the advantage and starts just spamming the rocks for the second win condition, there are, we've seen already, like, a chance for Scout to overcommit to that and die. And Gunner should have way more resources to just not die here. I mean, except the mobility, I guess. Oh, I guess these haven't been eaten yet, so... I guess not. It hasn't, hasn't occurred yet, but we'll see. This is the one. 
Um, and the last thing about the difficulty, it is a variant of has five times two that uh, the brain put together, a famous uh, mod profile from a great mod difficulty maker. That's uh, five times too spicy. We had tried it higher than that, and it just seemed too oppressive for a wider range of skill. It led to too many early losses, and we wanted to pull it back down from a harder difficulty, and this is what we landed on. It's still tough, um, because, you know, you're trying to interact with the game in such a different way. But yeah, so this is uh, 5 times 2 spicy fire variants, which is one of my favorite modes to play just in general. For the viewers at home, what does the uh, times two mean? Oh yeah, so it's extra enemies. Twice as many are being spawned that would happen on two-player scaling. And the spicy fire element of it, it just means that there is a lot more variety of enemies of the like threats, right? It can pull more stationaries and more... Uh, threatening enemies to be in the waves so it's not as much just like dense grunt waves there should be some some more things though we do mostly just see a lot of grunts running around I think that's partially because things aren't just getting killed constantly very true I think we just swooped by and saw that the resupply has been completely eaten so <laughs> okay, I was, was yeah, able to get up there three of the resupplies Oh, a quirk got stuck. It did. Uh, Excellent game. In case, in case you, everyone <laughs> at home couldn't see that the quirk got stuck. <laughs> I was, I was sitting there as expecting. I'm, this is my mistake. You know, in golf, when the cameraman just like really pans it wide, and misses the golf ball entirely. That's what it was. I thought Donald would come back up for that rock right away. I was just waiting. Now, it's definitely a learning experience with the camera. It gets a little bit better, but it is going to stay pretty jarring the whole time, unfortunately. I feel like I personally, you know, gunner brain, I probably would have saw, like, I probably would have been following Donald here and been like, wow, this is cool and all, but there's a gunner down there and he's <laughs> popping a shield and shooting stuff. I probably would have gotten distracted and switched guys, even yeah. though I wasn't supposed to, you know? Yeah, it was, it, it is a very tempting thing to do when I see there's interactions that the other player is doing for me to like swap over and look. It happens some too. Or I just kind of want to capture what's going on. Oh, a second resupply. That one was hard fought. That one was earned, not free. The knights are right out of the ground for that one. Oh, and there's our death. How many special powders were used? Do you know? Um, I... Because I don't feel like I remember seeing them before this one. I think well, I was running there. There I think, was, um, was uh, there was somebody who tried <laughs> the crossbow. I don't think it happened yet. In one of the games, we do see a different scout secondary. The but it was pretty popular. The crazy BM here. <laughs> yeah. Oh, the oh, leech. Oh, oh my goodness. Crazy. Okay, game two. We're back. Use my to swim off like that. This is one of these uh, very winding cave gens that's happened in like season three. I think they added this into point extraction. There's like this uh, sort of like minotaur labyrinth cave gen that can happen with all these tunnels. <clears throat> and these are tough because of the just trying to find all the stones with so many paths is pretty tedious. So. This is very lopsided with Scout Gunner again because of the just how hard it would be for Gunner to to freely roam this much space to find the stones. Dottle is so incredibly quick with it. Yes. Crazy. I do know that uh, it's somewhat surprising. Dottle is running rewiring mod on the drag. The idea on rewiring is to overheat and get the speed up from uh, hot feet, which is interesting. I don't know if anybody else was doing something like that, but it was a big component of, of Dottle's strategy. 
which is interesting. Not not an OC I think many people would have expected to be played in this. Carl, did you do any um, preparation beforehand with like, oh, obviously you did some theory crafting on builds, right? But did you do any practice runs? Uh, I didn't know practice, um, partially because I thought it would be funnier if I just played yeah. no practice and died. Instantly. It very much was <laughs> very funny, I will say. Um, no, and also like, I don't actually like the game. <laughs> no, <laughs> um, <laughs> no, the, uh, I also like. I don't even know where to start. I don't. I like. I don't play modded at all, so I don't even know how I would even go about making a five x two spicy profile, let alone booting into it and playing solo for a couple games. So. Yeah, and having to deal with the existential dread of like, why am I practicing for this? You know. Yeah. Like I'm going full well. I'm gonna, like. I'm gonna lose <laughs> the first time, you know? I mean, I kind of, um, I kind of appreciated that fact. You know, I, I hate to completely unearth this and talk about the races again like we always do mm. but um you know i i much enjoyed like sight reading the races because it's something oh, yeah, brand sure. new and it relies yeah. entirely on the player's own stuff rather than you know even if even if it's different seeds and stuff it's still further from sight reading than having no preparation at all but you know obviously the, the players are going to want some sort of theory crafting going on with builds and stuff and they want to know the rules ahead of time right but yeah, yeah that's definitely the the trouble with that where it's like it's more enjoyable to sight read that experience and then the trade-off is just like if you had not and had a little bit of effort it dramatically changes the outcome you mm -hmm. know but then doing that means that i don't know it takes away from some of the enjoyment of just doing it as is I think there's some aspect of that here too, which Ooh. is like, people didn't really have an expectation for how this was going to go at all, so there was small adaptations from players throughout the event. You can tell people realize, oh, there's a resupply I can use, oh, this is working for other players, you know, there's some things that get adapted, which is cool to see, just from... There's no meta. There's, there's no, no meta, meta so yeah, exactly. Yeah. Absolutely. I, I think the resupply thing is a really good example. Like, we didn't see a resupply until game three, and I think now we've seen it in every game so far. Yep. Right. I mean, sample size two, but, you know. Yeah. <laughs> 100% of two. Yeah, 100% 100 of two, yeah, compared to 0% of the first couple of games. Oh, abandoning the Accord? Oh, uh, the stab remains and the Vectora. Yeah, too much. Like back there this day. Oh, little a little bit doing. of teamwork. Now that being said, I don't know if I would have been killing stuff. Let's just gotta deal with it. Now let me. I mean, I nobody brought this up. Nobody has said this to me at all. I'm gonna throw this out here. You have this scenario where you're working together in the shield, and I think that that's a fun concept part of this. Oh, okay, oh. there we go. We have it down. That's rough. Dead to probably Mac Terra swarm. Yeah, and just losing the shield just before that. This is this is a great set. This is one of the most interesting ones from the events, in my opinion. Double scout here? Double scout again. Back to double scout. No more fun. Yeah. <laughs> Monsoonification and mercy with three C's and three Y's. So I was going to say, maybe there's a strategy in just getting in front of your opponent and blocking their wave clear. <laughs> just trying to help the bugs live while you're in the shield. But no, yeah, this is, uh, there's something very fun that happens in this match. You go out first. No, you go out first. <laughs> <laughs> now, this is interesting because I'm, I'm looking at the, <laughs> the table here. It looks like in every game except for the second round with Gearing and Peach. Yeah. Uh, different regions, like largely yeah, different regions yeah. for everyone. So we had a small uh, compromise for that, which is we had two possible hosts, one in NA and one in EU. Okay. And we would try to defer to what was best for both players and not make it insanely lopsided. You know, I think Harlem and Johnny had the most lopsided one because Harlem's NA had a really good connection with me and Johnny's Australia. So that was kind of lopsided, you know, but um, otherwise we tried to keep it relatively even, which I think we did pretty well. Oh, that was close. Oh, oh, oh. anti weak stack coming close. Crazy.
But we kept it we kept it pretty playable. I know probably a lot of the players didn't really want to have like 80 to 150 ping that they normally yeah. don't play on that, but it was just the best we could we could do for everybody involved. So for the technical heads in this 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 match is going to heat up, so I'll have to stop at some point here. <clears throat> just walking it in. <laughs> All right. Uh, the the two camera people are in this map right now, and then the players have been deleted. So we are in here when the level started, and now we're just floating around, following the characters. Yeah. Like they can't see the player cam or whatever, but you know when the level's generated, it is generated as like a four-player map. You know. Yeah. So just some. Some technical stuff about it, but I do have it scaled Is that correctly. Relevant? I have it's it scaled. Go ahead, sir. I just, I'm just saying that like the scaling and everything is to take into account for no matter how many people are in the map, it's scaled just for these two to go head to head. I you gotcha. know, For anybody who's curious about that, so this is crazy. They started the core stone in this map, and now it's just gonna be the new enemies, the crawlers, just like spawning constantly, unless they were to do the events. So they've created now an extra obstacle on top of everything else that's going on in this. So pretty intense. And virtually no desire to complete the mission here. Right? <laughs> yeah, I mean, there was a little bit of getting that stone, but now the new objective is to like, ha can I... Here we go with the whole resupply. Going to 100%. Oh, just... <laughs> All four taken. But now it's like survive and try to trap I mean, this is a very deadly scenario, deadly map that's being created. And the longer it goes on, the more oh, of man. these crawlers there are going to be. Yeah, I think you're still bulk up too. So. Not the best map to be playing on right now. I would have been just fine. <laughs> well, <laughs> this is where Gunner really could have some fun, you know, because you get one zip line and then you're just chilling. So, look amazing. Only melee enemies. Shout out to season uh, five. Yeah, Three. shout out to season five. More content I've never seen before. So. <laughs> Ghost ship games, you've done it again. They are a little freaky critters, man. Yeah, they are a little. They are a little. And they so do quite spooky. a bit of damage. And they just like yeah. throw themselves at you, it's so good. Yeah, they do do a lot of damage, and they also leave a uh, poison on the ground. Which oh, is another event here. Two events. Gotta get the bots in the mix, too. Yeah, I don't think anyone ever goes for that one. I think it's a little <laughs> bit too long to set up. Yeah. <laughs> a little bit. It would be lethal, though. Those, those, uh, those bots are very dangerous. Just barely too long in the same spot where this is monsoon, right? Yeah. Monsoon didn't like being there. Anymore. Wanted to grab it, I could tell. Just was like, no. Nah, I... uh -oh. oh, yeah, we got the steal. Very far to walk it though. Oh, oh, oh the re grab with it. And now the I men are here. Down, though. Gonna have to Guilt give it up, but but passes it to the side to protect it. Oh, but just too much pressure. Man. Very Too much pressure. A very good attempt, Mercy. It right. was, yeah. I think that was one of the most clever maneuvers that we see is Mercy throwing it to get space, but throwing it to the side instead of forward. Yeah, that's good. Because you don't want to pick it up immediately because then you have to walk it. So. Yeah. Imagine we're running out right through the wall. <laughs> <laughs> this bulk is still alive. I guess you want it to be alive because it's your Chance win of... condition. Yeah. If you don't get stomped. Oh, there was some fight over the health. But I guess you can only get as much as you can have to fill your own health bar yeah. at the time. Yeah. But leaving it on the ground makes it harder to spot. That's true, so. yeah. Much harder to see where it is. Oh! Oh, no. Okay. 
Sorry. Yeah, damage. I guess you could hide some little pockets of red sugar down a little bit or something. Oh. 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 Overshot. Lots of lots of points. Oh boys. my god. Okay. Well, Mercy definitely got it in. <laughs> a lot of little critters. I know. Things. It's getting to be a lot of guys. Their noise. It sounds like a Minecraft noise, to be honest. <laughs> The level of play from these players is yeah, like like I don't you know people who may be new to Deep Rock definitely have no idea how how locked in you got to be for this sort of thing. No, uh, yeah, yeah, it's, uh, yeah, absolutely true. I mean, we've been going for several minutes and no one's gone down. I think the closest we've been is a couple broken shield. But... I mean, it's like maintaining this ability naturally while also thinking about how to circumvent what you normally do, like help each other, you know? So it's like spinning yeah. two very different plates. One of them you just never really do in DRG. You're actively trying to avoid helping somebody else. All this and we're seeing the, the very interesting plays come out. Yeah. Yeah, and all the arc works getting with Dan. <laughs> yeah, the actual <laughs> mission's getting done, also. Yeah. <laughs> it's crazy. I've been done in air quotes, yeah, I think we're yeah, yeah, yeah. probably missing three or four, but... On looking back, I can see that this oh. map was just so insanely brutal. All the different things. Those oh, one, there's one another one for motion Mercy. from Mercy there. Very cool. Yeah. Now, do the side objectives count at all? I don't recall. So, there is a third condition if in case uh, the quirks, they can tie, the generation can have an even amount and people could turn in a tying amount. And the third condition is just total minerals mined and deposited. Okay. Which isn't the most fun way to pay out a, a win, but it's pretty yeah. unlikely that both people survive it, and get the exact same It's damage. contingency, you know, it's gotta yeah. be in place, right? That's exactly right, yeah. I think you might see it if both players are playing for objective. They both deposit exactly five, and then someone immediately called, and then right. You gotta go for fester fleas. Yeah. <laughs> so That's over depositing, play around this time. over depositing does count. We're like monitoring the total turns in, so like past the main objective. If they wanted to turn eleven or twelve in or whatever, they can for their score. They can turn it in on the drop pod later too, when it comes in, and that would count. So. That's also true. Yeah, I imagine it'd be very difficult. I'll just say. <laughs> yeah, I don't think anyone's gonna be taking that all the way back. Look out. at how oh. many guys there are. There's <laughs> so many. <laughs> yeah, that's a terrible spot for that. It no, right above it. It's crazy because this is this is monsoon. Right? Monsoon's thinking, well, why not? You know, if I'm down here, may mm. as well throw one more. You know, it's 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 just second nature to to go ahead and add one more. Try, try and add one more thing. I mean, yeah, they, they're so close. It's like it's gonna be hard for. It, I mean, you know, I, I don't know what the. This is game two of this round, right? This is game one, and Mercy does so. go down on the resupply. I guess really just trying oh, to get the heal. Right yeah. <clears throat> no, I don't know if these other two games are like this, but you know, it's. it's so there's that last a... one was probably probably the favorite of the tournament, right? Was was that last match? Yeah, yeah I think that that, that that one is the most. It's just the most crazy. Uh, that's probably what you envisioned, right? Like that's that's yeah. like picture perfect, like textbook, perhaps. Yeah. So that is it is important to say that that one is game one. This is game two, and we'll see why after uh, a little bit. Now, did did Monsoon get a drip change here? Or am I crazy? There is a drip change. Monsoon previously was wearing the uh, the med gown, like came into oh, the yep. mission, like having lost her previous game, and now the clothes are reset. That also trolled me so hard following on camera because I was like, "This is not who I was following before." <laughs> yeah, we oh, plus you one the barley bulb. Double check like that. Yeah, well, you saw instant resupply from both players and then immediately just ate the whole thing so not, <laughs> no more resupplies probably well, well, I can't anything. let them eat it you know <laughs> yeah, yeah yeah you definitely don't want to leave it on the ground for someone else to pick up so 
but maybe a bit of meta play there where depositing it into and just eating it is maybe tactical, but maybe you don't want to save it for later, but you know, your opponent can do it as well. So. Yeah. I mean, with a game that it was as long, I mean, both of these players know now that they're, oh, yeah. they are evenly matched. You know, there's, they're just gonna, they're gonna be going for a while, you know, maybe it's best to get it out of the way so the games are quicker. You know, maybe that's a, maybe that's something that we haven't thought about that, that Mother's Freedom Mercy would think about. Yeah. Yeah. Cur courtesy of the tournament, get it, get it over with quicker perhaps. I think that if you, let's say, if you do try to drain them really fast right off the start, just to move it out of the way, you are giving up your early game a cork turn ins, you know? That's but true. You are guaranteeing that you will be full health after your little thing, you know? So there's definitely some thought to it. Some thought now, to do we Now, do we see who dropped it on this one? I wasn't. Oh. Um, we'll, we'll watch on the next one I for sure. I but... don't know. They were both there to grab them right away, so. Yeah. But yeah, I did not see who it was exactly. Well, you know, if you, if you hear that one's coming, then you definitely are like, well, I got to get me a piece of that, you know? Yeah. Maybe I mean, that, it, even if even yeah. if the Aquarks may be more important, you know, your your dwarf brain cannot turn down some oh. ammunition and some health. The Stingtail almost got big damage there. There's, you know, I guess a part of this is it's 45 seconds for the resupply to hit the ground. And so you do have a little bit of like response to somebody else. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, where is it? Okay, there we go. Uh, there is some response to like, okay, I have this time to react to what's happened, but there's definitely a class mis mismatch when it comes to the resupply itself. You know, it, oh, I think it, it definitely helps scout a lot. So this one was a mercy drop, but Monsoon sees it and obviously wants a piece. Yeah. yeah, obviously we're going to see both players and, take through here. <laughs> and jokingly standing <laughs> underneath, that would have been very funny. <laughs> oh. Oh. Monsoon did not pick Monsoon up. I don't not, know if that was an not like attempted that. resupply drop. It looked like... Oh, that would have been... I wasn't even thinking about it. There was a power attack. I'm just not sure if it was... Oh my god, that... The value, the blow-through value on the grunts. <laughs> I don't see any marks on the ground. Yeah, I I don't know. Might have been on a bug in this. That's true. It's probably on. Oh, oh, I see what you're saying. Power attack. That was Maybe big an damage. attempt, but uh. Right. Yeah. yeah. A buggy. I, uh, Grunt definitely got killed by the power attack. I just don't know. And there it oh. is. Oh, sneaky, Stopped. sneaky. Stalker from up. downtown. Pulls up. That's painful. That hurts. The res? <laughs> and the VM oh replay. no! The VM res? <laughs> oh, that's tough. I think Mercy. it was a. I think Brutal it was a. <laughs> a mark of endearment. Okay, so here's why I said this is important that that was game one. Oh, in the right seeds, the... what the way we have it is there are two maps: game one and game two. And then game three, we had game the first seed replay. I yeah. think that makes it interesting. People can know what happened in the first map and make adaptations. So we're back on the really devilish Magma Core map with the people who made it so interesting the first time, and they have yep. gone ahead and done a sovereign agreement to play Gunner versus Gunner for this. Oh, interesting. So they they did they type this out in the in game chat? Yeah, yeah, they did. Okay. They had uh, agreed upon it beforehand and went in like this. Oh, <clears throat> that air This on. is a big play. Get the resupply down early, kill the bulk with the lead burster spam, then get all the lead bursters back, full everything. Yep, we done for your fun as well. Yeah, and it's a bigger difference here, I think, on double gunner, you know? Because. Yeah. Well, you also get your shield back too. Yeah. Your shield is very important in early. Thinking about whether. To break it or oh, yeah, no. taking oh, damage on purpose. It. Okay, that's right. Yeah, this is what we're this is what we were talking about a couple games ago, which is just that that adaptation as the event goes on to be like the meta isn't there and then it evolves. It's got a form. Yeah, it's got if a form. If if it's competitive, a meta will form 100 percent of the time. Yeah, that's what's yeah. that's what ended up I think for me and and probably for others what was so. I guess enjoyable about this whole event is is that aspect. Was there any just like was there any maps that were unused? 
Mm, I, I'm wondering if they found oh. just like the most juiced map possible with just the, the nastiest stuff going on and we didn't get a chance to see it maybe. No, I guess not. I think I think all maps were used because um, at least two games have to be played and because the game three is always the map one again, I think all maps were used that we had. I gotcha. There wasn't any again. DQs or anything. Yeah, starting it again. <laughs> it looks like Mercy's like, what have you done? <laughs> 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 Not gonna lie, this they made me a little nervous right here because I realized uh -oh, <laughs> See the first one? Uh -oh. they're gonna hang on the zip line and if all the enemies are just crawlers, we might be here for 45 minutes. So I was like a little worried. Maybe, you know what? Honestly, I feel like they both were thinking it. I know, that's what I was, that's what it did. It was so telegraphed. Well, I mean, thinking about it ahead of time, maybe that was a, a part yeah. of their dinner plan. Oh, oh, that's a lot of damage. It is. It a lot is. Of oh, close. And oh, the, oh, there it is. That was the death of you. The bramble on the oh. ceiling. Great plays by Monsoon, honestly. Absolutely. It was honestly great. Yeah. Excellent. Excellent. That would have been a good, you know, not to take away from anybody else, but that would have been a great final. Two absolutely awesome. amazing contestants. Hey, <laughs> I mean, you want to say how someone else died? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Round four? What do you think? <laughs> yeah, maybe we should run that one back. So now we're on to the second round of the tournament. This would be semifinals. We have Johnny versus Peach. So it's wrapped Peach back around to the top. Yeah, and Peach is EU, and so EU. we had. That's right. Out NG this time, first NG the tournament. That's right, first NG the tournament, so that's exciting. Very exciting. Let's see, we're gonna have to watch the NG gameplay. The Helldivers caves look so good. They're so. <laughs> yeah, I didn't. I, I love them. <laughs> did not know the out of them, and they look super sick. <laughs> All damage right off the bat, though. That wasn't too good. Insane 250 ping. Scout. This guy looks like Million in real life. <laughs> <laughs> nah, yeah, the wrong skin. The Johnny's skin? got the crossbow. You can see it right here. Yeah, no special powder. M1000 crossbow. Do we know if the NG was on uh, RJ? Yeah, yeah. Hmm. Each did play RJ. We will see some more of that. Now, how did this look on the, um, on the stream? Because there was a... A there was a a channel made for this, right? Yeah, so no. I guess this is a good time as any to talk about uh, the elephant in the room. So what we're doing here now is sort of recapping uh, the event that was lost, you know, and it's kind of like, uh, what is it, the, um, the a tribute to the greatest song? It's not the greatest song ever made, it's only a tribute. It's similar. So on the stream, we had the two different cameras with, uh, I was piloting one, I wasn't really on commentary, and Cube was piloting the other. And then H2 had the stream where she would swap between the perspectives, and her and Mira would be watching and commentating off of the two cameras, and then she would swap to whichever one had something interesting going on at the time, you know? Yes. So, but for this, the only remaining footage was my own perspective of the events, and it didn't have the original commentary, so that's what we have for this now. So this is it? This is the only footage from the whole event? This is the only thing that lasted, yeah. I mean, H2 has the graphics and all the other stuff, but from the actual stream, the only thing that was remaining that's was That's very unfortunate. Yeah, it is. Gone forever, too. Yeah, I'm, I'm not exactly sure. I, I can't really say what happened. The channel did have it set up to record the VOD and everything else, but I think, you know, if anything, it's just Amazon, Twitch, and a, a new account like you'd brought up. It was on a new account for streaming when it was done. It wasn't on, like, H2's Twitch. It was on a team Twitch account, and probably that was the reason why we lost the VOD, was just that it didn't have, you know... Twitch probably nuked it, being like, whatever. You know, it's yeah. just a new account, what does it matter? <clears throat> Which is surprising, because I think we were 
pop stream on DRG that day. But. Yeah, and it had been streamed on before. It wasn't brand new, you know, but it, you know, I don't know. I, I have no idea that the hiccups, there was a lot of, there was a lot of new <laughs> stuff, a lot of learning curves. I mean, we got the mod working for the camera. We were dual streaming. I'd never done some of that stuff. Like, I think a lot of us were really not super used to the whole thing. So it was a casualty yeah. of that. We even the players, I think none of none of us had ever, ever done anything else like this before. So. Yeah, that's definitely lots true. of new all around. Well, that's how good things start. Oh, I it's swapped new. cameras by accident, but well, maybe it wasn't an accident. Oh, because you caught the best. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I know what I know. Deal? I remember what it was. RJ it. looks like. <laughs> yep. That was a nice steal. Yeah, that's hard because Johnny worked terrible. very hard for that rock. It, yeah, I was yeah. gonna say. It. <laughs> <laughs> he was up there a long time for that. That was a long resupply on that. He there's uh, no resupply or resupply on that. Yeah. Pushing the rock up the mountain just to have a, your feet swept up from under you at the end. Yeah. Nobody talks about who's at the bottom waiting for Sisyphus. Sif Sif oh my God, Sisyphus to fail. <laughs> At this point, uh, the other camera had gone out temporarily, so I was following both players. So okay. I was swapping around a little bit. Well, you're saying you made it seem like that first swap was a mistake, but honestly, that was yeah excellent camera work to be honest. Perfect <laughs> timing, yeah. <laughs> and now I missed Peach going down here, but oh, it looks like it was a stalker. I can see the stalker walking off. So it was Bro. another stalker Bro. loss, Man. stalker kill. What are you on now? Four? Three <clears throat> or four? Oh yeah, it, yeah, at least three. So Peaches stayed RJ, which is cool. Johnny stayed old man scout. Let's go. Oh, splitter, sneaky splitter. Very dangerous next to the bomb plants. <laughs> <laughs> see, I'm on the edge of my seat right now. Some hot fall damage just taken. I think Johnny is he's got a, he's got a many jobs he's working on at once here. You know, he's trying to clear, trying to live. Just a lot going on, trying to get this rock. Just a lot of tasks. Oh, taking a lot of fall damage. Though. Oh, this can only be bad. Duck? No. Oh okay. he's God. Good. Yeah, he's to go. <laughs> Roller jump scare. Arquark -ark on the ground though. Oh, oh get it! Oh. And he's able to get it. Oh, surely they want to walk through the gun <laughs> all the way there. <laughs> all the goo. Johnny just gave up on that one. He said, "Go ahead, have it." I don't need it. Yeah, the gunk was not enough to stop him from just walking in. I see you, Scout, and I raise you, me slogging through this stuff. I think this is our third time attempting to put this off for <laughs> I think maybe Berserker was used previously, too. So we uh, also had the Red... Er, I'm sorry. Uh, Rocky Mountain was the beer everybody used just to let people get to the stones faster. But other beer choices might be interesting as well. I'm not sure. But every game, Rocky Mountain was the one that people were using. It does make a pretty big difference. You have uh, Red Rock Blaster could dramatically change. Oh, oh, we have oh, a steal! Oh no! The RJ steal! <laughs> oh, Johnny. No. Poor guy. And he's off. And he sees Johnny looking that direction and. Gotta, gotta. He's gonna get go all. I would think he's gonna steal Johnny's artwork he was desperately trying to get. What oh, was this drop? Yeah, we must have missed yeah, this peach, must have put, put this down, yeah. Well, you should be able to eat probably four here. Formers. I feel like you want to eat all of them after having the rock stolen from you, right? Oh, definitely. Oh, even if I... I, I think I think if you see this, you just automatically eat all four. I don't think you ever eat them on the ground. Uh, but, not oh. fast enough. Oh, RJ! Like Johnny couldn't drop it in time, and then another <laughs> oh, RJ. No. And then another RJ. He's able to secure it. And he couldn't oh, drop oh, it fast that's enough. Tough. That's 
That's all right. Yeah, I know. I know my boy Johnny pulls through in this match. I know it to be true. Gonna go 2-0. I can feel it. He's gonna take the whole thing down. That's gonna be infuriating. It. Johnny, Johnny's about to Hulk out. You've been waiting in line at the gas station, and then the Corvette just whips in front, takes the <laughs> the one pump that's available. You better be late your for car out of the way. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, yeah, obviously you got that arc cork out of the wall as well. Oh no! Bad day for Johnny. Yeah, Bad everything's day. coming up raw, raw deal. Doesn't matter if Peach just dies though. That's true. That's Very what I'm true. feeling. Hey, no anyone's game. Play it slow. Do your scout thing. Stay off the ground. <laughs> oh. oh. Grapples maybe a John little too early. Johnny, Johnny, Johnny I thing. know Johnny wants this steal more than <laughs> anything in the world right now. <laughs> After everything you've done to me, <laughs> he's thinking, you know what? I'm going to lead the bugs to this guy. <laughs> no, I'm coming with you for the thing. next one. I mean, that's kind of what you you feel like inclined to have to do, you know? you just like, I, I better consolidate all these threats to this person and hope for the best. Yeah. Well, you can see Johnny stopped shooting, so oh, I've met yeah. there, but... Are probably trying to keep things alive for him. I think at this it's point, like, Johnny has got one turn in, maybe. It's obvious Peach is way ahead on the stones. So, um, yeah, I'm not sure. This, this feels a little rough, you know? Yeah, shields are broken. Probably low on health here. No resupply, I don't think. If nothing else, this round has certainly showed us that other classes besides Scout are viable. Yeah. Absolutely. I, I do would... think that there is... Sorry, go ahead. No, 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 you go ahead. Okay, well, I was going to say, I think there's some kind of rock, scissors, uh, rock, paper, scissors at play here, where I think I think NG can beat Scout, because the RJ like counters a lot of the Scout's movement. But I think That's Scout true. beats, like, Gunner and maybe Driller, because like, you just don't have the mobility. You can just place resupplies in really good spots for you, and then not for your opponent. That's right. I would say that in testing this, we there Johnny goes oh, just succumbs to oh. the bugs. Sarah wasn't out. strong enough again. That was definitely an attrition that just did not end up in his favor. Absolutely. Round, Round three. three. Round Johnny three wants blood. Fits. Johnny wants blood for sure on this one. So in testing, we found that RJ has a lot of strength. Now, it's not super clear to me what's Ooh, the best. I mean, the scout seems really straightforward and really strong. But like Harlem says, RJ has some direct counters to what scout wants to do. Because RJ can make the scout move fast enough to drop the rock, you know, which is pretty good. If yeah. you can stop their turn in by forcing them to drop with the rocket, it's pretty pretty good. Um, there are other aspects to it. Platforms, we didn't really see platforms utilized in the tournament at all in a, like, really oppressive way, but they can be very, very strong in this to disrupt other players. You know, a platform just instantly could stop people from resupplying or place under their feet yeah. from far away. There's, you know, you can get people stuck in platforms, so our, uh, NG has, like, quite the kit for this. RJ just being a big component of that. Yeah, I definitely did a um, little bit of weird grafting NG builds, and like almost all of them were centered around RJ because of just how powerful the overclock is. Because I think I, I realized I think that RJ is the only thing competing with Scout for movement. Mm -hmm. um, I don't think Driller or Gunner have anything close. Certainly not. Yeah. Um, Certainly not. So and, and like there are certainly other playstyles that aren't just zip around the map and deposit arc works fast, right? Like we saw both Gunner games were very close even with none of them going for arc works really yeah so this it's got to just be the first i mean uh, what else do you think of when there's a bunch of enemies other than to do the drg hop and run away you know yeah <laughs> it's definitely true doing the scout thing is just the the default answer you know? yeah well you can see how many enemies how many enemies were just on screen it's like i think the only thing like there's there's, there's some gunner builds that can deal with that and some driller builds with cryo but or oh, flamethrower cool. but Oh, even flame throwing, yeah, that's true. It's just a lot easier to just run away and let, let them kill your enemies, you know, or your opponent. Now, yeah. earlier here, there was, I think, uh, I think Peach was going for an Aquark, and Johnny went to a second one over on the wall on the far side of the cave from here. 
and I'm pretty sure I was watching Johnny look back to see if he could get a steal in rather than get the a cork in the wall that he was closer to. Yeah. I think he it looks like he really wants blood to me. Yeah, I can but. see that now that you say that. I, I hadn't noticed that, but there is a lot where he Johnny seems to be glancing to check chances <laughs> here. And I guess that's sort of the strength of what's going on in this map, is that Johnny feels like, okay, well I know this stuff is here, I can just come get it once it's free, but let me make sure I'm not going to lose a stone to the minehead for nothing. Yeah. Well, you were playing the scout too. Like, mm -hmm. the, the movement is similar, but NG has to waste ammo doing his stuff. So That's right. You do have yeah. a lot more freedom to move around the map compared to NG. So you can afford to go for an arc like that's really far away and then maybe swoop into steel, whereas NG kind of just has to commit. Oh, oh, the grapple broke oh, on Johnny just you know, now. That I was actually going to say something about how would you deny your platforms from the other player, you know? Mm -hmm. and, and obviously, you know, I, I, my my first answer is make them bait platforms. That'd be absolutely That'd be hilarious. So you gross, know, that would have yeah. gotten, gotten a kill. That would have gotten a kill, yeah. That would have been, yeah. that would, I was thinking it, and then I, I really wish I would have said it beforehand, but... <laughs> Yeah, like not taking a. Oh, oh, oh no! Johnny! I didn't. I don't know. If yeah, that, that might have been a ping. A ping kill. But Johnny's been, out. Peach tough. moves on to one. Johnny, and, I'm wait. Johnny, I want to see you back next next uh, next tournament, dude. I want to see you back. Yeah, I think I think Johnny did a great job. Like, I really do think he was spinning a lot of plates in the games, trying to maintain a bunch of stuff. All at the same time. Johnny and Peach yeah. round one. That's what I want. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah back I know our to the Donald games. games. Yeah. So Donald this is Mercy. Donald Mercy. That's right. Yeah. Back on double scout. Though. Semifinals. <laughs> the octopus hat is iconic. I know. It's so good. Well, hopefully we've seen a lot oh. more of it. Stalker detected. Yeah, we'll see if it gets another kill. RJ used for damage. Or, I mean, uh, special powder used for damage. A bold play. It is just... It takes out, it takes out the leech, though. Very interesting. It is just so hard to keep up with Donald. hits able to get the rock out of the wall and see if they're able to deposit it nope maybe not my you know my first uh my first question was going to be are we banning special powder but Donald's the only one utilizing it looks like so i'm yeah we've seen it before but not to the extent that Donald's using it here i don't think yeah i mean speed is just a huge component of the kit for Donald. on top of what i said about rewiring and hot feet Donald also has dash you'll see maybe in this match I don't know that it's been apparent before, um, but that is a lot of opportunity to go quickly. It might seem redundant, but when it uh, when it occurs, there's a, a moment Ooh. where it makes a big difference having that. I mean, like, if you're playing the... scout and the scout, you know. That's yeah, yeah. That's any advantage you need, you need. Oh, oh. Oh, 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 God. oh just Donald recognized how. Fruitless it was, and just said, "Never mind, go ahead." There was no chance of getting it back. Yeah. That was a great steal. It was Leaves a great to steal. Maybe yeah. Not pull any more aggro, and then go for another one. The grapple there. I think Donald saw Mercy get even anywhere near that Aquark and shield launch uh, immediately. Immediately grappled. Big damage happened there. Doesn't even. Oh. Okay. <laughs> could have been, been punished for that for sure. That could have been, been yeah. And I, I think Mercy saw Dottle had him and then dipped. Maybe a good call. Probably same same thing that Dottle was thinking on the last yeah. one. That's true. You know, yeah. It's too far gone, but you know, you never know. I guess. Look at well, this patience. Like players are okay. Yeah. Game. It's both Might have a stone. Mercy's not looking for the steal, which. No. Maybe there was something there. 
But it was a one for one scenario, you know, may as well just keep working, you know, try to get a different one. Yeah. Well, I, th I definitely think Mer if Mercy spotted Dotto, I think they could have tried for mm -hmm. steal because, like, you have to throw the arc walk down to begin with, and if when it gets thrown down, you know, you can pick it up, right? So. Yeah, yeah. I feel like there's definitely an opportunity from being that high up to ferrying it down. Absolutely. Or maybe you would have forced Dotto into moving somewhere else instead. Right. Like that was an arc arc, main <laughs> I was, was going to say, I feel like I haven't seen anyone use a scanner at all. So. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I, I mean, honestly, genuinely, that gives you an idea of how, how much faster Donald's going than everybody else. Yeah. Yeah. Able to get into such a safe spot. To, and, and that wasn't just like a quick check. There it that was. was there that was, was a pre. There was a yeah, was dash your, usage right it. there to say, I am in a scenario where I have to get this and I do not want to drop it. Yeah. I'm sorry. Sorry to cut you off there. No, no worries. Just had to point it out. I just think it's so clever to have that, that you know, you have this opportunity where you are going to get hurts and you have to give up the rock to not get hurt and you want to turn it in. Well, now you have dash Ooh. and just get away. Oh! What's going to happen here? Uh, I got to bring it back up though. It could be... Oh! Ooh. Mercy not able to capitalize on the throw. The, destroying the geyser there would have gone Shield crazy. gone. Shield gone. Gonna have to drop no it. Oh, does have to Oh, throws it up. Oh. throws it up. Oh. Oh, Mercy's too far behind. I don't think they will really catch up here. Oh, maybe <gasps> not. Got up. And they got gonna shield gone again. Oh, Ooh, oh. oh. Back to grabbing it. That's it's getting be dropped soon. for sure. <gasps> oh. Oh, oh, clean. Oh, my God. Great. Absolutely Club Penguin with a mock clean. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> What an amazing turn in. It was wow. it was certain that Dada was gonna have to drop the rock on that fall. And then instead of dropping the rock, did a very late forward throw to the mine head. So it was really like untelegraphed which two things would happen, drop or the throw. Gave giving Dada Oh, oh. oh. Cheating? Oh, That's che random. I don't know. <laughs> Cheating? Oh my eyebrow is raised. Huh? <laughs> I don't know how you whip that one, but... Yeah, that's oh, definitely a tipper me. I mean, a bolt kill would have been excellent content, I think. That <laughs> was... yeah, it would be great. The... The stones to go right back to the bolt detonator is crazy. <laughs> well, back in the meta play, it looks like that was trying to get a reset by here. Oh, uh, yeah. yeah. Yeah, I've been focusing on the nitro I've been watching. Yeah. I mean, there's Maybe. really just such a clear distinction of of, of decision making on Dottle's part. I I would, I'm sure, say the same thing about what Mercy is doing as well. If I could follow and see the other things going on, but just being able to see Dottle, I have to say, it's like very interesting how these these priorities shift constantly in the games of staying ahead, stealing, living, resetting. You know, finding a rock, just constantly shifting around to what the game plan is at any moment. Yeah. But we're not seeing players go for rocks anymore, and I don't think the mineheads would have been leaving yet. So. I'm sure if there's still a cave you haven't found yet, or if you actually can leave it. Maybe, maybe we there. could see Donald pull up the, <laughs> the map again. <laughs> oh, resupply. Oh, we do have a resupply, I, and it's in the. No, I Mercy's spot, right there. Mercy's right there. But it is I in a really saw... nasty oh, place with this being so... Up, it's so choked here with the caves having a low ceiling. I thought I was doing some yeah. clearing. Well, presumably you have Pheromone here. Yep, Pheromone the yep. ground. You can take them all uncontested. No, I was on Mercy. is actually advantageous here because you don't get the ball or anything. That's true. Slasher. Uh, oh, nope, got the no, He doesn't That's care. That's a very good <laughs> read of what's going to happen. Able to eat all four uncontested. Where was Mercy during that? Probably a pretty big. Yeah, must be trying oh, to Mercy's find. Oh, Mercy's dead! Oh, Mercy's dead! Oh wait, on top of the drop pod, that must have been fall damage. Up in the drop pod tunnel. Oh, maybe you went up in the tunnel. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe got swarmed up there and didn't get the, didn't get it off in time. Yeah. So that's one one. Driller. They driller, again, driller agreement. I like <laughs> driller, it. Driller, driller agreement for this one. 
first drawer I'm we glad, I'm glad to get, <laughs> that we get to see Driller, yeah. And it looks like two oh. different primaries too. One sludge, one front door. Yeah. Those drills are gonna make it quick. Where did... oh, okay. <laughs> Bulk. Ooh. Oh, yeah, I think oh my fun. god. Oh. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> that was a lot of stuff. <laughs> yeah, Driller not exactly well known for taking out Magdara. So. Snowball's okay. Uh, unfortunately, it's yeah, <laughs> not allowed. <laughs> he's pretty good. Yeah. yeah no crowd can. Yeah. I think if crowd can was allowed, I think you'd have to see a lot more drillers. Like Driller's cryo is very the good. Now, do you think that Cryo Cannon would be stronger than Scout, like base Scout? I guess the I question mean, becomes, is it Scout's fault for getting frozen if the Cryo Cannon's allowed? You know what I mean? Because the Scout well, think, should be able certainly. to evade it. Well, I think, like, if you allow, like, if you can't remove the Cryo Cannon being able to freeze upon it, right? I think there are some scenarios where, like, if you're a Cryo versus Gunner, I think the control are always doing yeah. Um, like I think I think Joe just put me everything other than scout and like <laughs> <laughs> the the accord there. Maybe that's not good. The, the the bolt can have the accord there. He can have it. Yeah. So now we're in a really nasty scenario because the <laughs> men have appeared, the crawlers are here. Yeah. He's like, you dig, I'll I'll kill the enemy. <laughs> <laughs> Oops, now they're in the the unbreakable terrain from the event. Oh. Donald's foot fell out and died. Oh man! Died and, died. and Mercy oh, only nice. seconds behind. So That's that crazy. was yeah, quite an experience. Honestly, I think next time you let up on crowd cannon and see how it goes. Maybe you know round one, see how it goes. If it's too much, if yeah. everyone you know everyone's gonna want to try it, right? But if you see that it's too strong, maybe in the semis. Well, I guess or I should supporters. say I think yeah, it's. I would love to see it, and the one thing I have to just remind people that that don't see it because it's banned here, if you get frozen you drop the stone, and you do have to wiggle out. So the problem is yeah. on turn-ins for the stones as an objective, you have a scenario where a player is guaranteed to have to hold their rock, and they're in that scenario where they're just free to get frozen. Scout or whoever is just going to have to turn in with the driller puppy guarding that. But yeah, it definitely needs to be reviewed a little bit more, see if there's no. a contingency. I have two things about that specifically. A, does friendly make you freeze slower on a friendly crow cannon? I think it's been a long time since I've tested this, but there is a, there is the elemental resistance perk. We got to turn oh, okay. in from Mercy there. I mean, that combined with, you know, if they're using their ammo on you mm -hmm, mm -hmm. to f steal your quarks, then they can't use it on the bugs, which are much more important because that's really what we've seen as the prime. We haven't seen a single mission clear. I think yeah. the puppy guarding wouldn't be as big of a deal. And they'd have to stand in the middle in point extraction, which... Yeah, and I mean... You know, I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm not trying to say it, it's certainly should be unbanned or anything. I'm just... I'm, no, no, no. I, I definitely feel you on this. Now that we've seen it, I was worried it would be too oppressive going in, but now that I've seen what's going on, this early meta idea, I see that maybe it should be allowed, you know? And nobody's saying that the person has to walk straight at the driller and yeah. get frozen, you know? They don't have to. They could just throw the rock the other way, so there's a lot of yeah. there's a lot of thoughts for it. I also think there's some consideration, though, because, like, Snowball's going to freeze really fast, I mm -hmm. think. That, um... Yeah. And not a huge ammo cost either. But I, I think that like normal freezing, like it's just gonna take too long. Like I think it's gonna be very similar to uh scout crown aids. It's like if you wanna throw three crown aids, you have one arc arc. Probably yeah. not. Wait, this is the finals, right? No no no, this is semi-finals, bottom half this of the round. This is game we're on game, game three. three right? This is the right. third game of this set though, yeah. yeah so this okay. is game three. So one one obviously. Yeah, one one. Yeah, Dottle won the first game of Scout and Mercy won in the driller game. Yep. Yeah, I think we're back to double scout on some one. It's also possible I could adjust the. I mean, I think you mentioned this earlier on, and it's where my man, mind went to first as well, which is like I could po possibly find a way to adjust the temperature values for the, the players. Um, so that, you know, maybe make it less oppressive and then it's totally fine, you know? So that there's a modded 
contingency too. I'm afraid to open that door because then there could be so many specific balance choices to let classes be more or less viable, which is interesting. It's just a lot of work, so. Yeah. Like That's something to think about. Too. Yeah, <laughs> you know? some insane gunner buffs give uh, auto cannon RJ, you know, something like that. <laughs> I could see it. I don't know if I'd be shooting them. <laughs> Donald's shooting the stuff. I don't think I'd be shooting stuff. Uh, especially now with someone trying to get out. Yeah. Oh! oh that doesn't even go close, close Donald. That was a chance. It, I think it was a, like a through the legs scenario right there. Donald turned mm -hmm. to check behind to and see distance, and then right Mercy as Donald turned, it. Mercy did the throw. Yeah, I think it was <laughs> a good opportunity, yeah. Really good timing, though. Yeah, very good. <laughs> Donald turn around just to see the court going through, right through their head. <laughs> yeah. You turn around the court in your opponent's hands right behind you. <laughs> so you can definitely see some of the spicy element of modded here. We do have a, a pretty frequent uh, bulk. Uh, spawn rate and we have you know a lot of stalkers they're in almost every game multiple times a game and there's just a little bit more pressure than you'd have from the vanilla ambient stuff but i would say that point extraction has a specific point extraction passive that's grunts so it doesn't look like just pure threats the whole time it does look Pretty vanilla esque with some of the fights they have to do. Some manageability. Yeah. 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 I've totally lost Ottawa at this point. Okay, there we go. I was I was actually trying to squeeze in somewhere that you're. I can very much see that your camera work is improving for sure. Oh. <laughs> and then yeah, and then you're like, oh, I lost Ottawa. I'm like, well, <laughs> maybe not not a good time, but <laughs> no, well, yeah. But it, it's cer it certainly is improving. Yeah, I think all the non Dotto games have been. Very oh, yeah, I mean, <laughs> Donald's moves are like, like, where are oh. we going with this one? We have Donald oh, there's, double. There's checking oh. the checking the map. Oh my goodness, dugging out for Donald sure in the drop pod tunnel. I'm nerding out. I got my number one Donald fan shirt on right now. You guys, maybe that's it, how but... Mercy lost game one. Was the same idea using? Oh, try to do it like that. that and yeah, then... possible. Very possible. Very easy to start falling too fast and miss a grapple or. Donald was really I'm close, shotgun. yeah. If you saw there, I also tried to find them by going out of bounds. Um, and noticed that this room is completely cut off from the gen. And this is what happened in game one what as the... well. Oh. This room had all the remaining accords. That'll so, explain it. One of the that funky was... seeds that they chose had this. Ooh, but the pheromones saved like Donald though. from the <laughs> sure death. Hey, Mercy, where's... Oh, Mercy's going for the point right there. Oh, I can't let yeah. go. And then and the dash, dash, the dash so gets the turn dash in. stays the arc work. Yeah. Mercy's like, where the hell did you get that arc? Oh! Oh! Will you see an extract? So Doddle, I mean, Doddle's got to know if they're ahead or not. I can't, I don't yeah, know. Yeah, Doddle who's... is for sure ahead on this. So yeah. Doddle's just like, I got to stay alive. And Mercy's either SOL or got to try and kill him somehow. Yeah, this has moved the game into part two, which is Mercy now has to make up this deficit and has no chance to right now. It's like, Doddle has to die, or somehow they're gonna have to turn in on the drop pod during the extraction window, which is pretty tough. But I think Mercy realizes this and is in there looking for, uh, okay, for stones. Yep. And then the, ex uh, the exploding oh. plant, unfortunately. Yeah, tight room, really tight hard room. to play in. So, I mean, people probably aren't thinking about this. You'd have to turn in on the extraction pod mm -hmm. during this extra enemies by yourself. So yeah. The other player is not helping you like at all. <laughs> and they're gonna that's hack crazy. With you. That's exactly right. Yeah. That, they... That's much harder than usual. Yeah. Because yes. presumably you like realistically you probably need both. I think it was two arc quarks there. You probably need to deposit both of those. Mm -hmm. You're not depositing both of them. <laughs> it's no. just not gonna happen. Yeah. Like maybe you get one, but like. But I'm glad to see. I'm one. glad to see the attempt though for sure. Yeah. It was a good Okay, going final, into the final. final round, the final match, I guess. Teaching Donald. Mercy, excellent work. Yeah, excellent. Want to see you back yeah. in the next next uh, tournament for sure. Yeah, the Mercy's games were very good. The sets uh, were a Against lot Monsoon, of fun. Against Monsoon, the Monsoon yeah, ones were really good. Really great. Yeah, very good game. Sandblasted. I haven't seen this 
Just not a lost shield to them. Buy them yet. Yeah, I think Sandblast will lose some equity here when you don't when you have one hit rocks and everything else. Mm -hmm. Well, they had um, like what do you call it? They had a what? Wait, what beer wood did you have? Uh, you have Red Rock? It was uh, for Rocky. this. I'm sorry. Rocky. It was uh, Rocky Mountain. Rocky Mountain. Yeah. So, I mean, oh, stuck. Stuck though. Oh. But we do have oh. a new enemy in the rotation, which is we could have sharks, which is fun. And oh, that'd be awesome. We do have the sandstorm, which is uh, <laughs> oh, it's definitely annoyed. something to add RJ. to the mix for oh, this. Oh, it's it's engineer scout. I yeah, it's, it's yeah, RJ scout, in the finals. Yeah. Yeah. In the sandstorm. In the sandstorm makes that much harder to steal there. <laughs> It was honestly a decent chance to get the steal, if not for this this sand. Yeah. Battle finds the red sugar in the in the darkness somehow. Cross map. Well, Donald, huh? Donald can smell it. Yeah. The screen. <laughs> Got the axe on. And another quark through the screen. Oh god. Or, oh. Ooh. Double. Was that two hits? It was. That was a shield break for sure. Oh. Oh, another shield break. Oh, and the uh, the breeder the breeder spawns. We ever, I don't think we've really seen a lot of breeders in the tournament. The no. the native sites are. Or what are they? The little jellies. The jellies are crazy. Yeah, yeah, that's right. The fair no amount of to deal with them. Right oh, oh, oh. Oh. <laughs> oh, but dropped it. Oh, oh. Still it. oh my goodness! Dropped it again right there. Whoa. The last one was just for showmanship. Yeah. Right. <laughs> Wow. Rub it in. That, that was, was crazy. Yeah. yeah. I guess he fell a little bit too far in them. Do you remember how many behind in that last one? Um, Peach was behind Donald. Uh, you mean Mercy in the previous um, one? Yeah, Mercy was behind Donald. I yeah, think sorry. it was. It was at least two. I think it at might have been three. At least two. Three. Three. Yeah. Uh, I I have to go back and watch, but I think it might have been two. Yeah, I think if it's two, I think you're. I mean, one. Them. I'm thinking one's going to be tough. What is two? Uh, two. You're going to need like. Yeah. So one, you're you going to need someone pilot. special to do two. Three. I don't even think Donald could have done three. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we see. Well, they get the the. The turtle like key is inserted. We're doing the plus one, site. dude. <laughs> Give that plus one. <laughs> I mean, it is an, enemy, an all enemy scale, so we'll pull the but... So, this, I don't think Donald dropped this one, right? No. Could have been Peach to no, drop that no, one. Yeah. Why not take all three? Oh, because they, okay, Donald sees the course. And, and Peach is going to disrupt this Harass, if possible. Yeah. There's also a pretty dangerous environmental aspect that's right there, which is those explosive plants will oh, do I forgot damage. About this. To Maybe that was a bait. Wanna... It might have been a bait. Yeah, it looked like that was possibly a bait idea there. Donald tries oh. to rapid juggle in the air oh. off the special powder. I think. Hard now. Takes a hit though. Yeah. So um, probably looking for the resupply. Ooh, not crazy. enough. Not enough pushback from the RJ to drop. Got to get away from all that. I mean, we know from our our many months of playing Slam Gunk, you know. You kind of have to grab somebody right as they're jumping to really yeah. move them with RJ, you know? Yeah. You can't just shoot them out the first. But that helps. Throwing I mean, that didn't stop us path. from trying. Yeah. Even though we noticed it didn't work for the <laughs> yeah. first, you know? Yeah, that's shots. true. Oh! Oh, no! Was RJ able to get the steal? The RJ definitely... Oh! oh. 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 Was it oh, worth no. it? The grabber grabbed it the last second. Though. I know, Already that's crazy. Yeah, Peach uh, dropped drop, drop down, was not able to hit a platform, took some fall damage, broke shields. Looks like that uh, out, over the deposit. Might sound like a broken record, but Engineer certainly is viable. Certainly. certainly. I mean, it's certainly sick. You know what I mean? It's certainly yeah. cool. point. Plus, plus bonus points for judge yeah. favor, you know? Peach is the winner in our hearts. <laughs> yeah, so going into round two of finals here, or game two, I should say, sorry. And Donald's up one. Other breeder. Ooh! Good. Ooh! Bob my head protected a little bit, which is nice. I bobbed my, my head back into the left just now. I mean, starting with Dodge one that. before the turn in is even open is... Donald's pace is pretty... 
pretty serious in these games. Unmatched. Yeah. yeah. I mean, that, to be fair, that was also really fun as well. Very nice, easy throw mm -hmm. into the center, but yeah, very clean. Looks like we're gonna get a second one here too. Pheromones, yep. Pheromones, yep. Yep. Yeah. Pheromones have been looking very good all tournament. Well, but no cryo grenade, you know. Uh, I think <laughs> I, I don't know. Too. Honestly, honestly, genuinely, I think the pheromones might have it on the cryo, even if cryo is unbanned. Yeah. Because pharaoh gives you like what? Like, Seven seconds. Basically, free whatever you want to do with it. So, yeah. Free our part, free the <laughs> Trying oh. to mop out from underneath. Oh. Oh. I think that was a Donald turn in. I'm sorry, I I'm couldn't. I'm pretty sure Donald got there quicker. Got to the a quark first for sure. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that right, that right there is part of the downside of NG, right? Like you're mm -hmm. not like even though he was able to maybe get the RJ there, he was not able to capitalize because he just couldn't fall down fast enough. That's true. He could only be couldn't in the fall one down fast. Wise. Couldn't fall down fast enough and. After it gets turned in, Scout's gonna uh, reset much, much faster. Yeah. Exactly, yeah. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I love that angle. So good. What are you gonna do? You gonna drop it? Oh, throws it out? Sure yeah, is. It's <laughs> like another easy deposit for Dottle. Oh, Dash used. Dash has been used. Oh, though, maybe. really but, early oh, okay. day. Oh, it was Ooh. such a good attempt. That was close. And zip zoom, Doddle's out of there. Yeah, well, the going one. uphill though is going to be much harder than downhill. Again and against R, I think uphill against RJ might. I'm 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 kind of hoping for Peach here. I know, and uh, I mean you could maybe, really... maybe Peach gave up after the second one though. I don't know. Uh, you could really make it frustrating with Plats too for a Scout trying to come out of this. That's true. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, well, I, it looks like thing. this area is untouched though, so Peach may not even know about it yet. Yeah. Possible. It looks like this is the main arc. Noted phase. the second one. Oh, oh, oh. there's got Not some gonna. shield damage. Had to piece out. Yeah, I don't see. I don't see Peach. I don't see Red Sugar. Huge Barley Bull pickup. Plus, Plus one. one. <laughs> Peach has got a resupply down upstairs and looks like just took off of it. I got finally got some Red Sugar. Probably so low that wasn't Ooh, much, huh? Got the regram. Beautiful, beautiful, nice. beautiful regrab. Oh, right there. Peach is right behind. I was uh, expecting the wait. outline. I, would, I wonder if there's a way to just permanently get. Like maybe, I don't know. It looked like when you were closer. Like mm -hmm. look, you see this. Doddle is fully outlined, but Peach is only Peach is like. Yeah. Guns so we have a mod on for the outline, but sometimes it does this bug where it's only outlining the equipment. So I'm not yeah, sure why. Yeah, interesting. See, that's that's what I was saying. It's like I lost track of Peach, but it's just because right. the only the gun is outlined. That's right. I realized. But, you know. Okay, we're well, yeah, modding. With that's what happens stuff. in months. So. That's true. Yeah. Battle's just bailing out with the hundred enemies. Peach is down in the yeah. pit with two stones. Yeah. Bad spot. I don't know if anybody caught Ooh. that. The Donald absolutely got robbed in the bottom of that pit. Yeah, well, we're seeing down to NG here, where NG has to pick now as a solo pick both of those artworks back up, and he's not a big hit for that. And and even even Doddle was struggling doing it with like an excellent scout kit, like yeah, yeah. Now you gotta do it with NG. Surprised that Doddle didn't take the artwork as the top though. That was pretty pretty neat. Yeah, but... okay, you see both um, artworks still on the ground here. You know what they say: a uh, oh. two in the bush is worth one in the hand, right? Yep. For now, until <laughs> until you <laughs> still haven't gotten either of the two, <laughs> yeah, and Donald's totally like, you know what? Maybe bad. the one in the bush is better than, or the the one in the hand is better than the two. Yeah, oh, maybe get the easy ones first. Yeah, well, if they want to get out. They'll jump the I kind of wish there was a way just to see the objective HUD. Yeah, I know. It would like be nice to have the health, health too, yeah. Not, uh, uh, health would be good, yeah. Just know how close people got. Oh, that was... that was Some damage was about to come out. That was a good platform to save Peach's health. Yeah. The shields were broken and that was a lot of damage coming. It was been fall damage from that RJ. Yeah, I think the NG... That was like up the in their energy. business. <laughs> Yeah, the NG pods have been very impressive, saving a lot of damage from fall, where Dottles yeah. 
struggling on that. Brutalizing this loop bug, eh? <laughs> Poor guy. <laughs> so this is the second? Yeah, this is game, game two. Um, game two. Game two. Last the one. final set. Uh, who won the last one? Peach, just by a hair, right? I think Dotto... One of them won just Dottle by won barely. Game. Yeah. Yeah. Dotto currently won zero, Dotto. That's right, yeah. Finally got that second one out of the pits. Number three. I guess Peach just decided those ones were not worth the time. Had to migrate down, I think, yeah. probably due to the enemy pressure more than anything else. Dotto able to enemy pressure swiftly. Oh! Ooh! Oh, oh, and oh, left the oh. stone down. Oh my god. Oh, oh, the pig's back up. Oh. oh. Yen turns around. Oppressor, though. Be risky. Oh. Maybe Peach was waiting care. the whole time for Donald to get back there as soon yeah. as the enemies were gone, you know? And then look at that. Donald, or Peachy, or sorry. Yeah. Peach comes out with half of the two remaining. Maybe, yeah, maybe it was a, a, a well laid trap for sure. Because, like. Just to come out even, you know? Yeah, it was least. a good a good use of time to just puppy guard the top and be ready. Worked really well. Knocked Dottle off of the rock and the rock got out of the pit. That was awesome. Yeah, I mean that was a bold play though. I think if Dottle maybe played that a little tighter, could have gotten yeah. it out directly and then it really would have been a bad play. But oh see. That's true, yeah. It would just be I think it's such a huge risk. Oh, the the, oh, the grapple. No. Maybe the grapple. Oh, okay, oh, okay. All right. Good secure. Very, very. Tight, I think though. I think maybe we saw momentum from the grapple just secure that stone, despite the grapple messing up. I think that the speed up from momentum let Donald get there in time, which is kind of crazy. Yeah. I think the risk, you know, for stealing that stone, if you know that time is put onto stealing it from Donald getting out of the pit, and it doesn't pay off. Then you're so far behind, you know. Oh man, yeah. that was a well, fast that's certainly one. Certainly a dotted lead. Yeah, it's a certainly huge dotted lead. lead. Yeah, things are not looking good. No. And it's a big point disparity here, so it's just Dottle has to die. Yeah, I don't even know where you can start. Guarding the last to Quark. Double turrets getting set we up. Get the <laughs> turrets are coming out. I mean, maybe just, to, maybe just to not. Die, you know, lose from dying. <laughs> yeah. yeah, so far we yeah. haven't had any mission completions yet in the tournament, so... I mean, I it, if it's if there's a place for it to happen, it's certainly the finals. That's true, yeah. Show that these two players can, can make it through these difficult times. And, you know, even if it even if it ends here, you know, Peach, Peach put up quite the fight, showing us that NG cannot be scoffed at. I, know. I, I hate engineer, but you know, I, I got you gotta love other classes being shown some love. Yeah, yeah I mean, I it's so it's... exciting. Yeah, NG deserves some respect here for making it this far as well. Yeah, definitely. definitely a good time. It was definitely the most fun in testing for this event, in my opinion. Every everybody who was involved in actually testing the game mode. Um, I think walked away feeling like, oh man, RJ is so good for this. It's so funny. It's just such a rewarding way to play. So I'm glad yeah. that it wasn't just the recognizing Scout's dominance and we seeing a bunch of people just doing dittos with Scout the whole time. Yeah. I initially looked at the fan list and I saw no PP and was like, oh man, they definitely banned RJ then, right? And it's like, no, oh, RJ's illegal. <laughs> <laughs> so. Oh. There it is. Uh, no, that's tough. Peach is that's down. Tough. Only seconds left before the drop pot, I imagine. And we have our winner, Doddle. Peach, I certainly, certainly expect to see some more engineer gameplay on the next one, for sure. Yeah, very exciting. Yeah, very cool. You know, Millie, I I really enjoyed this. This was a good, a good time. I'm sure Harlem did as well. <laughs> I had a good time reviewing this. Thank you guys for hopping in and doing this with me. It it yeah. really helped, man. I appreciate that. Yeah, no problem. Much love. Yeah. Thanks for having me.